The Go-Giver by Bob Berg and John David. A little story about a powerful business idea, the tale of enigmatic Pinder and Joe. Joe, the go-getter is an ambitious young man, aiming for the stars. The harder and faster he worked, the further away his goals appeared, it seemed like he was doing a lot of going but not a lot of getting. So, how to get stratospheric success? Most people just laugh when they hear that the secret to success is giving. The majority of people operate with a mindset that says to the fireplace, first give me some heat, and then I will throw on some logs. Successful people keep their focus on what they are giving and sharing. Most of us see the world as a place of limitation, rather than a place of inexhaustible treasures. A world of competition, rather than one of co-creation. What you focus on is what you get. Ultimately, the world treats you more or less the way you expect to be treated. The five laws of stratospheric success are First law, the law of value. Your true worth is determined by how much more you give in value than you take in payment. All things being equal, people will do business with and refer business to those people they know, like and trust. First question should be: Does it serve? Does it add value to others? If yes, then does it make money? If you exceed people's expectations, they will pay you even more. For example. A great restaurant strives to defy imagination. Its goal is to provide a higher quality of food and service than any amount of money could possibly pay for. You give, give, give. But why? Because you love too. It's not a strategy. It's a way of life. Second law: law of compensation. Your income is determined by how many people you serve and how well you serve them. Nicole had been a talented grade school teacher. The parents loved her approach to teaching, and her students loved her. But she was not happy. She felt constrained by a system that was geared to teaching children only how to memorize and recite. She devised a series of games that engaged the kids' creativity and intellectual curiosity. But she could not help more than 20 kids at a time. She met a software engineer that programmed the games into a computer. She formed a company, got some seed money. After time, it resulted in thousands of new students in time. A stratospheric success. Your compensation is directly proportional to how many lives you touch. This means that you get to determine your level of compensation. It's under your control. If you want more success, find a way to serve more people. It's that simple. This also means that there are no limitation on what you can earn, because you can always find more people to serve. What you focus on is what you get. There are three universal reasons for working: survive, save, and serve. Survive, meet your basic living needs, save to go beyond your basics need and expand your life, and serve, make a contribution to the world. Most people focus on the first, survive their entire lives, but the truly successful people in all aspects of their lives focus on the third, serve. Third law, the law of influence. Your influence is determined by how abundantly you place other people's interests first. Your business will take off when you start focusing in what you can give versus what you could get. In any type of business, you need to develop a network, a group of people who know you, like you, and trust you. They may never buy a thing from you, but are people personally invested in seeing you succeed? They are your army of personal walking ambassadors. When you base your relationships in business or anywhere else in your life on who owes what, that is not being a friend, that is being a creditor. Watch out for the other guy. Make your win about the other person. Go after what he wants. Some people call it enlightened self-interest. Watch out for what other people need, with the faith that when putting the other person's interest first, you will create influence. What makes a person genuinely attractive and magnetic? They love to give. Givers attract. The law of influences works because it magnetizes you. Fourth law: law of authenticity. The most valuable gift you have to offer is yourself. You can excel at anything by adding value. If you need money, add value. If you need lots of money, add a lot of value. You can add value by being a friend and caring. Make people feel good about themselves. Remember this: no matter your training, no matter your skills, no matter what area are you in, you are your most important commodity. Deborah, after being divorced, had to restart her career. She went into real estate. She took over one year all the courses available. That taught all the strategies of closing a sale in real estate. After a year of using all this knowledge, she had not sold a single home. She decided to quit, but in her last day, 
she went to do her last showing of a house. Since it was the last, she threw out the windows all the strategies and protocols, and decided to be herself, so she just chatted and relaxed, she was herself. Oh! Surprise she landed her first closing. After that, more came along, and she became one of the top salespeople in the country. Just by being herself. The most valuable gift you have to offer is you. No matter what you think you are selling, what you are really offering is you. Reaching any goal takes 10% specific knowledge, or technical skills, and 90% people skills. The best closing strategy is being authentic. The best salespeople, generate rapport. They can connect and people always remember how you made them feel. Fifth Law, Law of Receptivity. The key to effective giving, is to stay open to receiving. Everything giving, can happen only because it is also receiving. All around the globe, all humanity is breathing in oxygen and breathing out carbon dioxide, so is the rest of the animal kingdom. However, the plant kingdom is doing exactly the opposite. Their giving, is our receiving. You need to make yourself, willing and able to receive in like measure. Because if you do not let yourself receive, you are refusing the gift of others, you are shutting down the flow. So the secret of getting is giving. And the secret of giving, is making yourself available and open to receiving. Now, you know the 5 laws of stratospheric success. Go on. And give amazing value to the world. And best of luck on your business. If you like the video, please subscribe for more valuable content.